just we're three weeks into camp or into spring ball now. Uh, just kind of give us your your update. Um, we stink. Um, we're not very good. Uh, the football looks awful. Um, I think we're running around pretty good. We got a we got a lot of key guys out hurt. That'll be fine, but. We got a, long, got a long, lot of young guys that have an opportunity to play the game, and they haven't figured out how to play the game right away. So we can't consistently do anything well. We can do it for one play, maybe two plays, but consistently we can't do anything well. So um, right now it's not not very pleasant to watch, but it's awesome for them because now they have an opportunity to figure out, like, hey, do I do I want to be a consistent performer at this level, or do I want to not be a consistent performer at this level? So um, they've got they've got a lot of work to do. Long term, though, can that be a positive that you're getting a lot of guys getting some reps? No, I'm sure it's, 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 it's now, awesome but. for those guys. Yeah, I'm not frustrated. They should be frustrated. <laughs> We're gonna we'll, we'll have guys that line up and like we'll find we'll find guys that line up and play the game the right way. I'm not worried about that at all. I'm worried about their futures and their careers, and this is their time and their opportunity. But it's great for them because the transition from high school to college it's hard. In high school, these guys, offense, defense, special teams, they ran circles around. That's how they got here. They were so good, they didn't have to be consistent. They overwhelmed the opposition. Well, you can't overwhelm the opposition at this level. So when you don't play with alignment assignment technique, when you don't play with good pad level and good physicality, at this level you get exposed to every down, which is wonderful. So now they figured out, okay, that's college football. This is Division One football. I'm not going to be wide open. I'm going to have to make contested catch. I'm going to have to make contested tackles. I'm going to have to make hard plays. The offensive line can block. The defense line can pass rush. So this is all part of And, you know, not everybody that goes to play college football plays. That's what they don't understand. They're all stars in high school. They all play. Some guys are going to go their whole college career and not play. So you have to earn it at this level. And because of our injuries uh, and some turnover, we got a lot of young guys with the opportunity. They, they could be earning spots right now or, or not. So we still got a third of the spring left. And, um, it's awesome. Like I would say, like there's no such thing as a bad day because a bad day you learn what you have to do to get better, and then you have an opportunity to go correct it, and or you have an opportunity to shy away from the correction. But so it's it's every rep's a great rep. Um, these kids getting this opportunity, like I said, careful what you wish for. I want more reps. Okay, you got more reps. You're running with the ones now. How's it feel? Like not so great. The ones it was great when I was running with the threes because their threes weren't very good. Now I ran with the twos. I got now I'm running with the ones. That the ones are pretty good. Like, like, well, this is how it is, you know. So, in the step to the NFL is the next. Like, it's all over again. You got to start all over and say that, that's a different level, and the game's harder. And then I got to either adjust or that's the last level you play at. So it's it's fantastic. When you talk about the mistakes, is it guys just not knowing where they need to be yet, or are they just maybe not focused for that that snap? But what do you think? How do yes. you kind of put, put your yes. finger? Yes. 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 Not knowing, not mental toughness to line up play after play, and you go fast and you get tired, and you know makes it harder, and you know, and it's 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 mental, it's physical, um, it's everything. Five practices left. You kind of hit on some of this already, but what are you hoping to get out of these in that last five practices? Um, just tons of tons of reps. Like that's what we need. We just need the same spring and falls about tons of reps. Like the question, how you think you're going to be next year? You get it all the time. I got no idea. Like we got a chance to be good. We got a good nucleus coming back, and we have young guys that we really like. Um, I wouldn't want to play with them tomorrow, but I've got five more spring. I got a whole summer, and I got 25 more practices in fall camp. Like we we got months to get better. But I like I like our young guys, and I like the opportunities they're getting. I just they got to figure it out, and they got to realize like this ain't good. But the nice thing is they're figuring out. They get to watch themselves on tape. Like they don't like when I say it in practice. But when they watch themselves on tape, then it's usually like, yeah, that wasn't very good. Well, I said, no, that was terrible. Like, yeah, was like, and we live in a real world. We don't like, hey, it's okay. You know, the old positive, you know, power of positive thing. There's no positive when they throw the ball to you, you don't catch it. You, like that, the defense wins. Or we throw the ball to you and you catch it. Well, the defense, there is, that's our game. Like this isn't real life. Real life, everybody wins. Real life, you know, the stock market goes up and everybody makes money, right? No, every single play out here, there's a loser. That's a fact. That's a tough thing about competitive team sports. You give up a sack. Well, I love that one of our guys got a sack. I'm saying, hey, great job, Rosie. But guess what? One of my guys gave up the sack. Like, that's, and there's no hiding from it. It's a physical sport, and there's, there's a 10 one on one battles every snap, and defense wins five, we win six, vice versa. Like, and that's, that's what's hard about being, like, people want. That's why it's hard to be an athlete. Oh, it's great being an athlete. Yeah, it's great being an athlete. Like, until you get to go out here and get sand kicked in your face. And, the, you know, we got six high school seniors that should be getting ready for prom, I always say, and they're out here battling, and it's hard. It's a lot of, like, and last year they were all state. Yeah. Last year they were state champions. 
Last year they were dominant. They were, they were LeBron, running around high school, owning the joint, getting every accolade known. Then they come out here and like, holy crap! With COVID, there's guys nine years older than them, you know. It's like, well, it's welcome to the well. That's welcome to life. The next step is not always an easy one, and so, but it's it's it's, it's overall it's been great. I appreciate it, Coach. All right, thanks. <laughs>